In this video we will talk about how to get rid of anger. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel to be notified when we upload new videos daily. You tend to have sudden outbursts, be violent, overreact over petty things and generally be angry most of the time. You may not be aware but you might actually have anger management issues. We act and communicate our anger differently. This emotion is usually triggered by something that does not confine with what we think is right and pleasing. It is something unpredictable. When something in our environment irritates us, the mind tells the body to react in a certain way. People have different levels of tolerance. Some tend to be more capable of containing their feelings or express their anger more constructively than others. There are some who have rather poor ability of releasing their anger. These are individuals who have control issues over their emotions. For people with this problem, they have the tendency to act with such intensity that they hurt themselves and others. They are often overwhelmed with the need to be with such aggression in releasing their anger. Violent tendency comes naturally when a certain environment appears to be provoking them. It is okay to be angry as long as you can handle it well, as long as it does not become destructive. After all, we are human beings. But when it actually creates a problem, then we should come up with ways to manage our anger. There are several forms of anger management. The most common form is through relaxation. This is through doing away with intense emotions and letting yourself be in an environment where you could least likely be angry. It could be through unwinding, being involved in physical activities that prove soothing for you such as yoga or meditation. It could also be just by letting go of any negative feeling within you. For more complex conditions such as when anger already causes psychological problems among others, a more scientific approach could be used. This is through seeking professional help. Visits to the psychiatrist are always kept confidential as how other forms of medical assistance are handled. But it can be costly and treatment can last for long periods of time. On the other hand, Hypnotherapy will also assure you of privacy. In addition, you will not be required to take any medication and results can be observed in 1-5 to five sessions, depending on your anger management issues. More than anything, you need to be determined to change. This includes acknowledging that you have a problem, being willing to understand yourself and loving yourself enough to do away with negative feelings. I hope you found some useful information and tips. I look forward to hearing from you. Warning! None of the information on our videos is a substitute for a diagnosis and treatment by your health professional.